happening. Your name? Um, Larry Spritzen. <sighs> Jefferson Lawrence Tankersley. Today's date? The day after Christmas. So December 26th, 2021. How old are you? 51. What do you do for a living? What's your daily life? Or currently, I do pest control. For who? Northwest. All right, what's something big that happened this year? Uh, Grandy got cancer. That was big. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Violet was born. That was big. Um, I got a job. That was big. <laughs> What's your favorite memory from this year? Violet would be a big one. That was that was good. Uh, How did you celebrate your birthday this year? This year? Mm -hmm. I don't remember. I we went to Texas Roadhouse. Mm -hmm. I don't remember much more. I don't really either. I think yeah, that's probably what we did. Yeah. Alright, what are three words you would use to describe your style? Style? <laughs> yeah. Uh trendy. Um Envious mm -hmm. and cutting edge. Good. What's your go-to song right now? Go-to song is I like that one that we just heard. That was a good one. Which one? And we the people. Like we the kingdom. That. We the kingdom. But what song are you talking about? The goodness of God. Uh, yeah, the goodness of God. That's a good one. Yeah, there really. are better ones that I could, I could think of. That say. You like the uh, Agnes Day. <laughs> Yeah, but that's, I mean, it's only because it's got a climax at the middle, mm. toward the end. But I like, in terms of likability, I like um, We the Kingdom's, uh, which one is it? We the Kingdom, there's a lot. Holy Water, the Devil song. <laughs> no, no, it's the one um. there. But I also like... Uh, was it Chris Tomlin or Chris somebody? Tom Christman? The one where, you know, the people? Yeah. Yeah. What's something you're looking forward to in like the next year? Hopefully more grandkids. More grandkids. And, and uh, more grandkids. A better, hopefully a better job. And hopefully a new home. That we can keep our, our current one, rent it out, but cool. be in a better place. What are you afraid of? Uh, I guess being alone. <laughs> That's true. What's your favorite thing to do in your free time? Be with people. That's also true. <laughs> What's the last movie you watched? Jingle All the Way. No. Yeah. No, date night. Date night. And the proposal last night. Uh, the last one that you said. Yeah, sure. Dream job? Ministry of some kind. Uh, you know, where you're at, on the ready at the call for helping people. Um, so some sort of discipleship, evangelism, something. What advice would you give your or teaching? I like teaching too. Yeah. What advice would you give your future self? My future self? That's a hard one. Um take it easy on your body. Huh? That's a good one. Favorite movie? I've always liked The Firm. The Firm? Yeah, but I'm sure there are other favorites. I just need, I've never sat down and
tried to memorize. Here's the list of movies I like, and this is always at the top. I just that one, that one, a few good men. Those come to mind because I like the legal thriller stuff. Yeah. Favorite meal? I mean, I like steak and potatoes. I like the Thanksgiving as a meal, as a holiday meal, is my favorite with turkey and stuffing and cheese balls and all that stuff. But um, I like lasagna. I like Italian. Okay. What country would you visit today if you were given a free plane Scotland. ticket? Scotland. Great Britain. What technology came out this year? Uh, what are your thoughts about it? Like, what new technology kind of blows your mind? Those dudes that can fly. I don't know if it came out this year, but that's, that's one of the things. Kind of like the Iron Man thing? Yeah. It's crazy. And it's just getting more and more that way you know mm -hmm. so we're gonna have an iron man at some point okay goals for next year i think you already said kind of what you're looking forward to yeah 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 we'll go with that okay last one whatever you want to tell the audience what whatever you want to say what do you want to leave us off with um Tell about Christ. Don't forget that and be faithful to the scriptures because they are reliable. Uh, it's God and family and then country. Uh, and cut. <laughs>